Hi, this is Stephen Kingston here and today I'm going to teach you some basic features and sketching features in CATIA V5. First, let me click on one of these three planes here and then click on this sketch button. This opens up the sketcher. On the right, you have the various sketching tools here and let me just start with a rectangle. When you single click on a rectangle, you'll be able to draw just one iteration of it and you just get out of the command. You can draw more rectangles. If you double click, you can keep drawing as many rectangles as you like. For now, I'm just going to keep just one rectangle. Just select this and delete it. You'll notice that this rectangle is white in color. It means it's under constraint. You can move it around you can change its size and shape. F to fully constrain this you'll we'll have to make use of the constraint option here. Single click or double click on this. I have double click now and add dimensions constraints to it. After I have added dimensions now I can change its size but I can still move it around so, so to fix its position I'll have to add another constraint just click on this corner and the origin here and add a coincidence constraint now we'll notice that this rectangle has become green which means it's fully constrained you just can't move it around now it'll be just fixed in its place Another method of fully constraining this is by using an axis. Just click on this axis and click from this corner to this corner. Now to fully constrain this kind of sketch, just double click on constraint and click on the axis. You'll notice that this sketch has become purple because if I add and add a dimension to this line, uh, it over constrains it, and it's it's bad for the sketch. Now, click on this and the origin here, and then click midpoint. This also makes it fully constrained, and this is just another method of fully constraining a rectangle in Katia V5. And I'll be teaching you more about sketching in the next video. Thanks for watching.